Hey everyone, I'm Dan Klepler, and here are the top five stories buzzing online right now. Coming in at number five today. So it looks like Dame Maggie Smith, she had it right. PBS just announcing that Downton Abbey's sixth season will be its last. Smith, who plays the Dowager Countess, foreshadowed the news earlier this month, and now producers have confirmed that they will be closing the doors of Downton Abbey this Christmas. The creators, they're promising season six will be full of all the usual drama and intrigue, but we can also expect all those storylines to come together. It is a sad day for fans, but they will certainly be farewelling the show. On a high note, with 51 Emmy nominations, Downton Abbey is one of the most honored shows on television. Coming in at number four, and another end of an era, this time for hip-hop fans. Adam Horowitz, a.k.a. Ad Rock. He's confirmed the Beastie Boys are officially finished. Speaking to GQ magazine, Ad Rock says there is no way they'll continue without fellow band member MCA, who passed away three years ago. For the future, well, it's looking pretty bright for Ad Rock with a bunch of other artistic endeavors on the go, including a memoir and a starring role in the new film, While We're Young. That's alongside Ben Stiller and Naomi Watts. Hopefully, we'll also continue to fight for the right to party. Coming in at number three on this Thursday, fans of Benedict Cumberbatch are finally getting a look at what his wife, Sophie Hunter, wore on the couple's wedding day. So, here it is custom-made silver lace Valentino gown showing off the bride's growing baby bump. So this photograph was taken by Annie Leibovitz for Vogue magazine. It was shared on Valentino's Instagram and it shows fans just a little of a creative process at the famous design house. Sophie and Benedict were married on Valentine's Day and are expecting their first child together, their Cumber baby, a little bit later this year. Coming in at number two, would you like a side of fries with your fashion? Well, McDonald's is hoping so because the fast food giant has launched a range of Big Mac themed clothing in Sweden. It is every bit as bizarre as it sounds. The burgerific line, including everything from rain jackets to activewear, even housewares with models parading bed sheets on the runway. Or as McDonald's likes to call it, the McWalk. It's all part of a global day of marketing stunts for McDonald's. But if you really need a pair of Big Mac rain boots, those right there, they're actually available online for purchase, all the proceeds go to the Ronald McDonald House Charities. And coming in at number one, it is gonna melt your heart. An unlikely duo gaining loads of fans on Facebook. Meet Chip, a five-week-old Chihuahua puppy, and Adele, a four-week-old kitten. Both arrived at a Texas animal shelter, orphaned and alone, until they found each other. And then they became the best of friends. And now they do everything together, from snack time, to snuggle time, to play time. Once they're old enough, the staff hopes that they will be adopted together. Be sure to tune in to GMA for more pop news tomorrow. For ABC News, I'm Dan Plepler in New York. Have a great day.